So, ladies and gentlemen, the, uh, the launches and developments just keep coming on the New Orleans stand, uh, and we found another one for you. So now, I am with Mr. Why well, Mr. T7HD, <laughs> also known as Andreas Menenkes? Menekes. Menekes, yeah, there Menekes, we go. Yeah. I'll get these right one day. So, T7HD, it used to go up to the 315, I believe. Is that yeah, correct? 315. And, uh, now, now you we are... get to 340, uh, yeah. 340. Not only more power, yeah, uh, yeah, like we have discussed a little bit before. But but I see you've not just got the you know 10 mil spanner. No, 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 up, not, no, a bit more not, than that. not like we have done in the past. No, yeah. <laughs> uh, or uh, <laughs> in the early past. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. No. Uh, so yeah, how have you achieved more power? in the uh, in the T7HD because I assume it's still the 6.7 litre it is, FPT it is. which I would have thought 315 horsepower is quite high for that size of engine yeah. and now you're really it's got to be almost on its limit is it the customers ask us yeah, for, for more power you just want more yeah all the time <laughs> more yeah never yeah. satisfied more, more performance yeah more more pulling performance in the field and the 315 was not enough even yeah and then uh, <laughs> we we saw that we have to give more power and um, yeah this is 6.7 liters engine yeah we have uh, in the past it is a brilliant engine yeah mm. uh, but okay that's the maximum of the power which we can get out of yeah uh, out this of is the maximum now is it with the 340 so Obviously, it is the 340. Is that 340 horse rated or that is max rated power? and max power at the max same power. time? Yeah, right. no boosted. Yeah, we yeah. have it always available. So right. this is the top of the power curve. This that the is the top of the power right. curve exactly, and um, that is a big difference uh, to to the two smaller models, to the 290 and uh, three, uh, 315. Yeah, yeah. On the 315, we have the 300. Uh, uh, rated, yeah, and yeah. the 315s max. Here we have really an absolutely flat curve where, where the 340 is rated and um, the 340 is the max power as well. Right. Yeah. Before you had you had three models in the T7 HD, and yes. now you've still got three. So have you dropped the bottom yeah. one now? That's Exa gone. Exactly. Oh. We dropped the uh, 275. Right. That's the one. Um, by uh, Launching the T7 300, yeah. There we would have the, the oh, overlap, yeah, yeah, see, yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, from the long wheel base, and um, so uh, we dropped the 275. Yeah, start with uh, 290 now. Yeah. yeah, the 315, and now as the big top model, uh, the 340. You got the big lady now. Beautiful lady, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whatever floats your boat, mate. Anyway, so you got more power. Now you're gonna have to handle that power. You're gonna have to handle the heat. Yeah. So presumably you've done something with cooling. Must yeah, have done. for for the more power, we we need a little bit more uh, cooling performance. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we changed the radiator fan. Yeah, uh, for higher capacity. Let's say he has one um, 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 wing. Is okay. It, is it the right Another word? blade. Yeah, the, blade. Yeah, blade. Uh, blade. One blade right. more uh, for more for more performance. That is what we did. Um, Engine-wise, yeah. yeah. Underneath, uh, we we improved uh, the drive line uh, still. Yeah, yeah. We, we did a, a bigger um, hydrostat, which we included. Yeah, for with 18% uh, more um, capacity. Right. So that's a heavier duty CVT on this. Yes, yeah. actually, uh, that will come for all. Uh, that's going to come down. Uh, come to right. come down to uh, to the 290 yeah. as well. Because it's but, just auto command in these models, isn't it? There's no, there's no power shift in these models, it's just no, auto-command. It's, it's just auto-command, yeah. uh, only always CVT. But that brings us more performance in the field, yeah, yeah. especially in pulling performance. Um, and have you done anything to front axles or anything like that? Or is that... No, that is... That was good uh, enough, was it? That, that was good <laughs> enough, yeah. Uh, so driving performance was brilliant. Uh, and uh, comfort, um, yeah. New cap uh, two years ago we, we launched That's it. That's right, yeah. a little bit longer, a little it bit is, wider. Just. Yeah, a little bit wider, uh, quite a big step longer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, for more roominess, yeah. uh, uh, especially behind your seat. Yeah, so I can push my seat back. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, you're tall guy, but uh, <laughs> yes, uh, th that's working. Um, 
the complete interior we we updated with more storage room yeah with um, smart features yeah and um, yeah new armrest intelligent 12 yeah 12 inch um, monitor yeah, yeah it's, um, so just give us a little just before we wrap up just give us a little refresher around the back end sort of uh, hydraulic pump capacities lift capacities things like that Okay, yeah, we have um, around about 11 tons of lift capacity, yeah, um, we get new uh, rear remotes, yeah, uh, Bosch Rexroth uh, rear remotes right. with um, uh, high flow per, per remote with 140 liters an hour. Per remote? Per remote, yeah. Really? Yeah, that is um, what we mention always, yeah, and um, yeah. In the back, you can maybe see the hydraulic cap suspension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, if we have it right there, we have um, yeah, hydraulic uh, stabilizers for, right. for the okay. rear linkage. So that brings a lot of comfort. Yeah. What we add now um, is our um, system big baler motors, uh, big baler mode. Yeah. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I've heard of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. you heard that. Um, if I'm working with a New Orleans um, big baler, big square baler, yeah. yeah, big square baler, we are recognizing um, the, um, the, you know, the shaking. Yeah. That's it. The, uh, yeah, basically every time the plunger stroke, exactly. You get a little thump uh, when, in the back. When when the plunger is uh, coming up, yeah, yeah. Uh, you get an engine whoop, yeah. Right. And um, you start. Uh, That's right. You get a bit of a rock the, on. Yeah, uh, the cap Cheeky. is starting to rolling. Yeah. Um, that we recognize yeah, uh, when the next plunge will come. Yeah. Uh, so the engine will um, have a different setting. Right. Uh, um, that we don't drop the um, the engine RPM as much. Yeah. So we give a little bit more fuel so before it, the plunge is coming. It actually. So it counteracts. The exactly. Punch. Right. Exactly because it's always yeah we have a frequency yeah. and then we know. Okay, in a, in a half a second, yeah, the next plunge will come, yeah, yeah. And, and exactly before the plunge will come. A little engine yeah, flip. That well. the engine, uh, engine RPM is not drooping as much. Right. That brings more, more capacity in, in the complete uh, cycle system, yeah. Right. What we do in addition is we, um, we uh, stiffen, or the, the stiffness of the cap, yeah, yeah. at the same time. At the same time. time. Yeah, when we go down, actually, we uh, stiffer, uh, is it the right word? Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, the, um, the hydraulic cap suspension, that the rolling of the cap is uh, limited, oh. or uh, is, is uh, slower, yeah. or uh, um, yeah, less... Uh, less yeah. movement, so less it stiffens movement, it up. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So that you are, when you're sitting on the baler, or on the tractor, yeah, yeah. doing bailing, you have a way better uh, comfort inside. And does anything happen with the front axle suspension as well? That always, yes. That yeah, happens as well, right? That <laughs> happens as well, yeah. You, um, you mention yeah, uh, you <laughs> mentioned it. Um, at the at the same at, time. At as the well. same time, yeah, we stiffen the uh, the the front axle that this complete rolling of the of the cap yeah. isn't um, isn't happening anymore. So right? you got the cab working, the front axle working. And the engine doing some work as well, all counteracting the plunge, the plunging effect on the back exactly. of the tractor. To 17, we get the silver medal uh, for that. Right. To 90. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so um, sorry, uh, uh, but um, yeah, now uh, we get it uh, into the machines, yeah? and uh, really um, great, great feedback which we get from these uh, systems. Yeah. Great stuff. Well, Andreas, it's been an absolute pleasure. Really yeah. enjoyed that. Thank you to visit us here. Yeah. Thank you very much for your time, as ever. And we shall uh, well carry on round this uh, round this mammoth shop.